What's good, people? This your boy YC Fail, aka Marcel. You already know the biz. I'm just here doing another uh, interlude. I said intermission on the other thing. May have said the wrong thing, but uh, here to talk about pretty much what the entire media world is going completely insane over. Uh, they're going crazy over my homie. You know the big boy, Beast Mode. That's what they call him. Marshawn Lynch, the man who can't stand the media, and obviously he got his reasons on why, and I'm like him, I could care less about the media as well, you know what I'm saying, but he's who he is, he's his own man, this is how he do, this how he roll, he said it last time, he said he's just about that action, boss, but the media world constantly want him to keep talking and being in front of everybody, see, let, let me tell you something about Marshawn Lynch, yes, this league is controlled, I'm going to say it over and over again, this league is controlled, and Marshawn Lynch already know. He not trying, he ain't finna be no puppet like the rest of the cats is. He he don't wanna be no puppet. That's the problem. He like, listen, I, I might have my endorsements and all that junk, but I'm not finna be no doggone Illuminati puppet or whatever you wanna call it. I know people say Illuminati, you know, ain't got, but whatever, regardless, whatever. He ain't trying to be no puppet. That's the bottom line. You know what I'm saying? So that's why he constantly going on and doing these, got these little segments where he hop on. Talk about I'm just here so I won't get fined. Now he's going out talking about some you know why I'm here. And that's the bottom line. He's right. You know why I'm here. We won the NFC Championship. I'm here to go and we try to win the Super Bowl. That's it. You know what I'm saying? But you know why I'm here. And that's what he feel like he got to do. And that's what he got to do. And that's what he do. That's like I said. You just make it do what he do. Forget all this goofiness. Like I said, I applaud it. You know, I'm 100% behind it. People can look at me like I'm a buffoon. People call me a buffoon anyway. They call me on my name anyway, so I don't give a crap. So, I mean, it is what it is. This is the homie. This is what he's doing. And this would be funny if the Seahawks can pull it off. If they manage to win and he just so happened to be the MVP. The day after the Super Bowl is going to be funny as heck. I'm not playing. you talking about funny. you talking about funny, funny, funny. Because here's the deal. The, the person who is the Super Bowl MVP not only gets the car, but you got a press conference the day after the Super Bowl. You got to go in front of the media. You got to go. You're going to Disney World. And then I think you have breakfast with the man Roger Goodell. Now, this will be very an uh, awkward moment because, you know, Roger Goodell in the NFL love to find this man. I mean, look, they trying to find a man for this hat. Obviously, you know, he's been wearing a hat, but obviously they don't want to wear it. But he been wearing it. You know, and that's what he do. It's so you feel like, you know what I'm saying? Do what he do. You know what I'm saying? Make feel, you know, do what he do. And this will be funny as sick if they somehow find a way to win and this man just got to the world where be the MVP. I'm busting up laughing all day. I said, you know what? The next the day at the Super Bowl is going to be funny. It's it, that, but they got to win, though, because I'm not counting New England. Now, New England, they got, a, they got a good team. You know what I'm saying? They... I mean, like like my man Sterling Sharp said, if you got Tom Brady, you're gonna have a chance. But Tom Brady got some, he got some uh, cats, he got some wide receivers. You know that boy Gunkowski is is something to deal with, and their defense is is no joke. You know what I'm saying? And that boy Blunt, Blunt, I think Blunt just as good as this dude right here, man. So we got a good matchup going into this game. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I can say it's gonna be pretty funny. This game gonna be real funny. That's what I say. Media week, that like said the circus they do, the circus atmosphere that the leagues and all these fools that come out the woodwork asking the most retarded questions on the planet. I'm telling you, it just don't make sense. That's why I said I can't. I don't like the media either. To me, the media is gay as heck. And for people who understand, you do know what media stands for. Media stands for mass evil demons in action. Yes, I'm gonna say it again. Mass evil demons in action. That's all I'm gonna say. Holla at you, boy. A B Smoke. One word. One word. We going out. You know why I'm here. Holla at your boy.